What's up peeps and welcome back to Israel Plays. I'm doing a little video on some bargains I got at IKEA today. Um, the sale is still on continuing, it's ongoing. So if you want to go and grab yourself some of this stuff. I mean, it's nothing huge, it's just a few knickknacks, but I went in there for one particular thing and I thought, okay, it's the sale, I might as well pick up some other stuff. And I couldn't resist these things. Um, the big thing I bought, I'm not going to show you what that is today because I'm going to do a project on that. Very exciting project. Um, so I'm going to show you the little things that I bought and I'm going to tell you how much they were. Um, this one wasn't on sale, but I always buy these little candles, tea lights, and these are going to... Oops. <laughs> so yes, these are vanilla scented candles. They are beautiful. I always find that Ikea's candles are the best. There's never any question about how they're going to work because, you know, you get these candles where they're a fire hazard or, you know, the wick comes out of it or whatever else. This does not happen. And these burn for many hours. They are four hours each and they're tiny. So four hours, that little candle and the smell of them are so nice. They don't give you a headache. They're not um, overwhelming, if you get what I mean. Right, okay, let's start off with the simplest thing. Um, these little things, I thought, they're really handy. They're pink. You can't really tell on camera. They look white. They're like a pastel pink. And basically, they have, let me open it up. They're, scent, they're basically scents or fragrances or air fresheners, whatever you want to call them. And they've got little holes on them so that you can... Um, decide how much of the scent you want to let out at one time and you can close it and open it like that and it's not open but you, you know there's a little bag in there with some whatever it is that makes the smell it smells so nice I love it um, <clears throat> let me see if the receipt shows us how much they were before and what the sale I don't think it's gonna I used to work at Ikea, I should know all this by now, you know, since I haven't worked there, I can't even work out what's what on a receipt, this is crazy, 555.70, anyway, they were 45p, so I got six of those, they are fantastic, they just look so nice, and I've got birds, so I can't have these all over the house, but I will definitely, I have already put one in my toilet and one in my bathroom. So that's the first thing. And then these, look at these little tea light holders. These were 50p, they're gold. I'm going to open one up. Um, I can't remember what their original price was, but I think they were about 150 And I think those scented things were about that as well. And they're like a little, they're not plastic or paper or anything like that. They're like a, a really thin metal, but they are so nice. So I'm going to stick a few of these around the place and put my tea lights in there. I got how many of these? Three, four, I've got five of these. And for 50p, you can't go wrong. You can buy these for people for... Not Christmas, because that's gone. But yeah, you can buy these as a present for people with a little pack of tea lights. Why not? They look so glamorous. I mean, no one would ever guess they were 50p. So get them while they're in the sale. Okay, that's the second thing. And then I got these. I need to check how much these were. I think they were a pound. I'll just read this receipt quickly. 46132... God, I can't remember how much they were. 90p. They went down to 90p. And they are basically for candles or tea lights. I'm going to open one up so we can see it better. And I can tell you what it feels like. It's heavy. So, it's metal. And there it is. It's black. It looks so smart. Three candles in there or some little tea lights. You can have a row of tea lights in there. I've got some of these candles, so I'm going to put some long candles in there. 
And what did I say, 90p? Can't go wrong. Okay, that's that one. So I bought two of those. I didn't want to go over the top because I don't really have anywhere to put decorations in my house. I've got these napkins. I always get these. Um, they're about 80p. Small napkins, but they kind of unfold into larger napkins. And I keep those at the dinner table. They are very handy. And then I bought this. I've forgotten how much everything was now. This is crazy. I think it was a pound, this one. Um, 65. Let's see how much was this. Okay, no, they were 45p. They went down to 45p. This is ridiculous. I mean... Come on, these are glass, so you've got three of these. They're tea light holders again. I do love tea light holders. I'm going to open that up so I can show you it better. I don't know if it's just going to slot in the side. I can always just take one out. They've got three colours, almost the same colour. One's a little bit of a darker shade. I think that one's a little bit darker than this one. This one's more of a turquoisey colour. Yeah, look, when I hold them up, you can see, actually. Ain't they beautiful? 45p, you need to get in there. They are in the um, candle section. Um, like I said, I used to work in Ikea and I knew it like the back of my hand, but now I am a bit rusty. Um, these can be found just after where the mirrors and stuff are. The picture frames and the mirrors. Of course, it might differ depending on your IKEA, but check that out. How beautiful is that? This reminds me of stuff from the 80s. Maybe even the 70s and maybe even the 60s. Stuff your parents had in the house when you were a kid. So, yeah, nice little tea light will fit in there perfectly. You can even get bigger tea lights for these. You can even put candles in these. They don't have to be tea lights. So I've got two of those. And once again, these are so good as presents for people. Even Valentine's Day presents, that's coming up soon, February. The shops are full of Valentine's stuff right now. Um, you might not want to buy the traditional boring chocolate flowers, hearts and balloons. And maybe the person you're with would appreciate a bit more thought. Okay, I always buy these, so nothing special about these price wise they are the same price as they always are let me check how much they are actually they're basically sandwich bags or food bags i always buy these because my kids have packed lunch 175 and you've got two sizes of bags in there if this can focus at some point hello anyway so you've got uh, 0 0.4 liters and one liter bags 14 fluid ounces and 34 fluid ounce bags. I'm going to open it up to show you. They are, these are the best bags ever. I don't buy any other sandwich bags anymore because they just always seem to be a letdown. These are fantastic, but I hate throwing these in the bin. I mean, I recycle stuff, but I really hate getting rid of them. So that's a small one. You can fit a sandwich in there. That's like the size of a um, piece of bread, sliced bread. And then you've got the slightly bigger one as well. They are a lifesaver, especially when you've got kids or if you take lunch to work, definitely invest in these bags. They have so many different colours. Uh, I think they've got turquoise or blue, red, yellow, white, and they um, are all different sizes. So you've got the really big ones as well. So if you've got stuff in the freezer that you want to put away, if you open something and you want to put it in a different bag, you know, maybe the peas will spill everywhere. They've got the, I didn't show you. Nothing special once again, but they've got like these little Ziploc things. But without actual, you know, anything that you need to run across. You just press it with your fingers like that. I love these. I swear by these. I always make sure I've got some of those in the house. Um, okay. And... Got two more things to go i'm really impressed with this um i need to try and remember how much they were again this is a lantern 
I love gold. So yeah, once again, it's got gold on it. Let me just see what number this is so I can check it on the receipt. Uh, two, two, seventy. Hang on a minute. I think they were 270 can't remember what the original price was were they three pound or five pound or whatever but I love them and even if they weren't on sale of course being on sale makes everything that much better let me get some scissors because I can't get this sellotape off so yeah they are basically little lanterns and you use them to put candles in it's got a glass bit and try to open this without killing the box because i do like keeping the box for a little while until i've decided where they're going and i don't put any candles in my sitting room because that's where my birds live these are adorable they are like little genie lanterns they are such good quality they've got the glass bit on the top and you just place it into the bottom it's got the little bit where you hold it i better not break this it's hollow inside so it's not too heavy but it's also not too light so it feels unstable or anything and yeah you can put a little tea light in there and you don't have to bother with all that trying to reach into it and whatever because you just place the glass over it imagine how nice that looks when it's on wow so your Valentine, if your Valentine's anything like me, I'd appreciate this over a, a bunch of flowers that are going to be dead in a week. Okay, last but not least, oh, I'm amazed with this. I think these were five pound, but they've gone. They went down to two pound. Oh, three two sixty eight. Let me just check that. Double check on the receipt. Sixty eight. Where is that? They went down to 180 and they were five pounds as far as i remember so again i'm crazy about candles i love all that stuff i love decorations i mean for many years because i've had the kids in the house messing about and my son because he loves football is to kick the ball around in the house so i never used to have any glass or anything like that but now that they're a bit older i can start getting back into decorating my house better again um of course i've got the birds to think about as i said so I can't really use candles where they sleep and all that, but I can put some stones in there. I can put some glass in there, some decorations. A candle goes in the top. You can even get them fake candles with the little flickering light on the top. So I could do that. But imagine your dinner table with two of these on, or if you've got a massive table, three of these on for any kind of occasion. Christmas has just been and gone, but for next year, why not? Valentine's Day, candles, romantic dinner, nice one. And you can put whatever you want in there. I mean, I'm going to open it up so you can see how big the um, opening of the jar is. It's, it's like a vase. You can even put some water in there, put some flowers in it. You can put some petals floating on water. Oh, the possibilities are endless with this look at that great quality glass i love the way the neck of it just does that so it hasn't got like anything on the rim of it it's just slightly bumpy on the rim and yeah imagine your favorite lily blossoms or whatever <laughs> roses rose petals just put a little bit of water in there maybe put some glass at the bottom um you could put little tiny logs in here you can put chippings of wood in there, whatever you want. I mean, you could put sweets in there if you want. And then, of course, you've got the bit that goes on the top. And you could use that separately. You could even use this just as a vase. Two pounds. That is free, basically. And that is it. Of course, I bought some batteries from there as well. I always buy my batteries from IKEA because they're a lot cheaper. And they do last. So, Alkalisk are the batteries you can get them in all different sizes they are fantastic and that's the video so if you want to get any of these bargains get down to ikea now i can't remember when the sale ends but it's going to be soon so i'd get down there as soon as you possibly can 
to grab some of these bargains because they're not going to be around for long they've got all sorts of things as well they've got this other lantern thing i didn't buy that because it was red and red's really not my color and decorating but it's a little lantern that you uh wind up and it lights up and it's really cute and many other things that obviously i didn't buy today but if you get down there you might absolutely love some of the stuff they've got and everything not everything but all this kind of stuff of course some other stuff as well is on sale so don't miss out on that sale good quality stuff at ikea whether you shop there or not generally their prices are really good but right now they are fantastic so get down to ikea peeps right well that's it thanks for watching i'll see you on the next video i'm going to be doing a few more um videos on clothing hauls and stuff like that um i'm going to do dresses and if you're thinking of getting dressed up for valentine's day or whatever else don't forget to come back and watch that and uh subscribe to the channel so you get notifications press the little bell otherwise you won't get notifications and that is it thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time peace out